Yeah, more than 100 people came here to look through UNM's observatory telescope up there and put on these glasses and watch in awe as the moon covered the sun. A cloudy Monday in Albuquerque didn't stop many from keeping an eye to the sky. It was so awesome. Well, it kind of looked like the sun was actually covered by the moon. We are a little bit off the path of totality here, but we can still see a partial eclipse, and uh, that's pretty cool. People in my office were like, but it's eclipse, like, you're never going to see this again. And now that I'm here, it's actually really amazing, and I'm glad that I was able to see it. Here in Albuquerque is going to create about 73% coverage. And now, that sounds like a lot, but the sun is very, very bright, so you're hardly going to notice the difference. It's way cooler than I thought it was going to be. People here at the observatory say seeing pictures of the eclipse just doesn't compare to going outside, putting on the glasses, and experiencing it yourself. My pictures can't capture what it actually looks like when you're watching it. Um, but it's just amazing to be able to see the moon and the sun come together. Nobody who came to UNM's observatory Monday morning wanted to miss the rare event. But I'm able to get some pictures and I can show my daughter later and say I was here. It's pretty awesome. I think it just speaks to people. This is such a simple scientific thing that we can view directly with our own eyes, so to speak. Now, Dr. Pilstrom told us if you miss this eclipse, there will be an annular eclipse on 2023 that's going to pass right through Albuquerque. The only difference between that one and the one that happened today is that the moon will not completely cover the sun. Live at UNM, Chris Cordaro, KWT Action 7 News.